Welcome back to my channel, Math and Language, and we're going to discuss how to convert Celsius to Fahrenheit. So how are we going to convert Celsius to Fahrenheit? All you have to do, if you have a given Celsius, you just have to multiply it to 1.8. Then the answer, you will add 32. Simple as that. Now, for example, we have 50 degrees Celsius. And you want to convert it to Fahrenheit. So multiply it first by 1.8. Like so. And that will be 8 times 0. 0, 8 times 5, 40. 1 times 0 and 1 times 5. And you add them. And one decimal places. That will be 90. So for the 90 there, um, you have to add 32. And that will be around 122 degrees Fahrenheit. So 50 degrees Celsius is equal to 122 degrees Fahrenheit. Remember, the cel if it's Celsius, we want to do convert it to Fahrenheit. Multiply it by 1.8. Then you add 32 to it. Simple as that. Now, how about, for example, we have a given, let's say 100 degrees Celsius, the boiling point of water. How are we going to do it? So again, just multiply it by 1.8. Sorry, let me just remove this one. 100 times 1.8. So that's around 180, right? Now you add 32 to it. 180 plus 32, that will be 212 degrees Fahrenheit. So simple as that. If you have a given Celsius, you multiply it by 1.8. Then the answer you have to con you have to add thirty two to it. So the boiling point of water is either one hundred degrees Celsius or two hundred twelve degrees Fahrenheit. And that's the end of the lesson on how to convert Celsius to Fahrenheit. If you have questions or in need of clarifications, please comment down. Again, this is James, your math and language instructor. Please like and subscribe and also click the bell notification so you will be updated on my future videos about math and language. Thank you very much. See you again and please support educational content. I'm on my way on my 10k my subscribers, subscriber milestone. Thank you. Bye.